Alrighty, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having an absolutely wonderful day. Today, we're playing a little bit of Human Udir. We're just a guy, okay? We know a bit of karate, though. It would appear we're playing Black Belt Udir. Very simple. We're not transforming into any animals. It's, this was a lot cooler when Udir actually did transform into other animals before. Now he just takes on the aspect of them. But uh, at the same time, I don't think it'll be nearly as bad. <laughs> Dude, that was like an omen coming to get me. That sneeze came out of nowhere. It's almost like it knew that I was telling a lie there. Um, yeah, it should be fun. If you're interested in uh, stopping by, comment some silly like uh, builds in the comment section on YouTube. But if you want to play in the viewer games that we do on EUS, we're, I'm maybe trying to do some more on North America now that I mention it. Twitch.tv slash Ross Boomsocks is always available. Uh, to come and say hello, maybe drop a Twitch Prime, a little Primer. And uh, get a video like and subscribe and stuff if you're new here. Because that's, that's all we do. We just do silly builds. We have some fun. So, I um, when are the Arcana shirts being sent out? So, the, I, I just got the approvals through. So, I sent through the thing like, here's the order. Here's how many we're going to get done. And I got the approval thing through yesterday. Um, but I, I want I want to actually sit. I, and I had to stream today. So I, I wanted to sit down and spend a couple of hours going over every, absolutely everything. Making sure that everything's fine. But it should be in production Monday, which would be the 14th, Monday the 14th, no, is that right? Monday the 14th, all right, and then it'll take maybe like two weeks, so we'll pr I'll probably be receiving them about the end of the month, and then they get fired out, and then we're good to, we're good to go, yeah. So I want to see like early November, in a best case scenario, things obviously change, because like we're getting quite a lot of t-shirts made. Because people honestly overwhelm me quite a lot with like how much they cared about the Arcana stuff, you know. So, but I'm excited. I'm excited. I I'm, I get to see like a lot of the ones that we never got a chance to release and stuff like that. So I'm I'm very much like looking forward to, to all of that, man. Honestly, it's gonna be fun. Me and my mum are gonna be in the motherfucking trenches. Oh wait, sorry, we're two minutes in. I can swear, it's fine. Me and my mum are gonna be in the trenches. Like, I've, I think I said this a bunch of times, my mother helps me a lot with Psycho, with the packing. Um, so like me and her, we've had some, we've had some bad times in the trenches. Like, you know, we have like a big bunch of orders and stuff like that, but it'll be fun. It always is fun with my mum. I'm seeing her tonight, actually. It's actually her birthday today. Like, this, it's the 12th of uh, October right now. It's her birthday today. So after stream, gonna get, like, the, her and my brother are coming over. I'm gonna have dinner with them. And that'll be fun. I'm looking forward to it. Mm, 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 mm. She's 69. Chat. Behave yourself. Tell we say happy birthday. I will do. Honestly, I will do. Because she comes in the stream a lot as well and says hi. I did one time ban my mother. Uh, this is a weird story, and I've, I've told her before, but I'll tell her again. She she came into my stream the first time, but she did not tell me in real life that she was going to do that. So she came in as somebody called like Ross, like as like Mom Boom Socks, and was talking as if she was my mother, and I did not know that that was my mother. I thought it was just like because you know my channel was doing really well at the time, and I was like, ah, it's a weird fucking weirdo weird little weirdo who is come in and tried to be like weirdly parasocial and be like oh yeah that's my son i was like are you like role playing or something like what are you doing you fucking weirdo so i permanently banned her and then i got a text message about three minutes later being like you banned me haha -ha. and i was like oh my god i'm so sorry i am so sorry oh dear i rectified the mistake but the damage was done unfortunately Honestly, the queer on human Udir, it's a bit slow, but it's not that bad, surprisingly. Can maybe go here, actually. Ain't that game ass? I'll be- bruh. Listen, look at my queer, man. Do you think it's bad? Nah, it's alright, innit? Do you want to see a fucking gank? I'll show you a gank. Okay, maybe not mid lane. He's just John, man. This guy, it's not Udir, it's John, and he's punching anything that can, it's in punch radius, man. Don't disrespect John like that. Look at him go, man. He could batter you and your dad at the same time. 
Okay, I'd mm, yeah. I can maybe hold David if you want to leave. I, I think it's a it's maybe a bad idea sticking around to you. You haven't got any mana either. But at the very least, I can hold it. I will not push it out. In fact, I could just hold it here. You know what? You know, yeah, yeah, yeah this works for me. This works for me. Just hold it here. There we go. That means I get a little bit of CS, a little bit of free. Oh, maybe I don't get a little bit of CS. Get some freebies. I guess some mark of an now. Good guy, John comes in, holds the wave, man. Bosh. Um, you sh. Mm, nah, you're not gonna get it. Sorry. This is not the return of Dorito hands, John. This is John, but it's not Dorito hands because they removed the Dorito part of his kit, man. Which is bullshit, by the way. Like, what's fucking Riot's problem, man? What's their deal? I'm, I'm kind of, this is like stat check, John. But he doesn't have a whole tremendous amount of stats, so maybe it doesn't work that well. You know, I'm gonna actually clear up towards Grubs. I, I definitely can't contest Grubs, but at the very least, I can know that it's happening. Which is half the battle, one could argue. So, we'll see what happens, man. We could turn it upside down. I appreciate that, Wukong. You don't know him. I appreciate that, brother. <laughs> He's fucking ollied me? <laughs> He's level 6 already? Goodness gracious. We got a really solid like, right there, so just speed, right? Don't, 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 don't chase too far. You will have Wukong moving uh, upwards into Orn, possibly, but like, I'm not going to be there to support. Yeah, no, man, it's too late. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. That happens. Live for today. Give me that. Tiamat would go hard as well. That made the query so much better. Wukong's pissed. He's not. You don't five. You don't five grab me on human idiot, man. You don't five grab me on. You don't six grab me on human idiot. I should say. Sorry. You know what? I mean, you can th two, three, four, five grab me, but you ain't six grabbing me on idiot when I'm playing human idiot. Are you really doing no stance, Udyr? I don't know, boss. You tell me. Kinda looks like I gapped the, the Wukong a little bit there, mate. I uh, I stole his grub. And then he emotionally ulted me. And didn't kill me. So... You tell me who's really winning this game. Okay, we got Wukong there. This has to be worse than AP Garen. You've got no faith, man. You know that's your problem. You little faith. Mm. It's a little bit awkward. We have got guys though, but I... I'm so squishy, it seems very scary actually. And I don't have smite. I mean, if we could just collapse on him and kill him, that would be, like, probably fucking ideal. Oh, did he field smite as well, man? That's, like, the worst part. He actually fucked the smite. Oh, he hit me. And he's gone straight back. Oh, my God. Nobody died? Wait a minute. I'm scared because, like, Wukong could actually come back in here. This this actually looks really, really, really bad. If we could just, uh, abandon ship here. I'm, like, I'm worried that, like, Wukong's, like, maybe here. Maybe, like, here. And I'm obviously just going to go check them because I'm stupid. This Chinese is busting. I knew it'd be great, man. I'm glad you're eating it, though. But it's not going to be as good as the giant chicken ball. I'm, I, you know what? I, I'm, I'm really looking forward to playing a champion that has abilities soon. The last two games I've played, I've played like, builds where like they don't actually cast any spells. And they're just all attacking. <laughs> I don't know. But at least I get to like chill. I can just check my phone and shit. Like, what's going on? Not much. I was talking to my therapist today. I gotta, I gotta admit, I want to apologize. I don't think I ever was like harsh on therapy as like when like earlier, you know, over the over the years. But I've certainly been like not receptive to participating in it, you know. But I did start therapy like a little bit, like a couple weeks ago. 
like two or three weeks ago and it's been like a very positive experience and like uh the my therapist is like really nice and she was actually just like texting me on her day off today showing me like her kids and stuff like that and you know just talking to me and i was like no oh. it feels nice feels like you're kind of like in the trenches with somebody it's not it's not clinical you know it's not just like a if, I mean, I know it is like a business relationship, and I'm not, I, I'm not, I'm not going to be one of these people that misconstrues that relationship any other way. Um, but you know, she's sharing stuff with me. I'm sharing stuff with her. It's, it's very nice. It's very pleasant. It's very pleasant. Uh, I was wondering if he had Ali. He does have Ali. That's okay. He seems very, very strong, and I, but I do wonder if it's because of who I am right now. Uh, bust me down that. You know what? I'm 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 eager. I'm happy to sell this to get Tiamat just for the extra wave clear. We're gonna get a gank off though, but it doesn't look like there's a lot that's gankable, frankly. Botwing doesn't have like a crazy amount of kill pressure because it's Vladimir, and that's just how it be. I don't do that much damage, so I feel like I wouldn't be able to support Orn, and like then David's having a hard time against uh, Yoni, so it's just all a bit awkward. All but I'm there. Should I get a therapist if we start league? Why do you think I have a therapist to begin with, man? I'm joking, obviously, League of Legends has not done this to me, but... I don't know, it's just, it's just good to, like, I'm just, I'm having, a, like, a, a clear out of the mental, you know? It's also not nearly as expensive as I thought it was, you know? I mean, I guess it, it adds up, obviously, but it's something that I put off for a bunch of years, and <clears throat> and I get to, like, have a bitch and a wine, and maybe have a little blubber for, like, an hour, like, once a week, and then be like... Okay, cool. I got like all those feelings out in my brain. Um, you know, maybe I can like move forward. That's it. Very positive, man. Therapy, therapist, wake up, sheeple. True. Would you rather take a a creepy peepee -pee or a spooky dookie? I'm unsure. I think I'd rather take a creep a, a, a spooky dookie, man. If I'm honest with you. I've got, I've got the fucking Muay Thai stance up, man. It's not a spooky poopy, it's a spooky dookie. Man, he actually does fuck zero damage, man, in human form. This is, this is crazy. I thought he would do more than that, man. I thought he would just be, I didn't realize it all came off his abilities, man. There is still a grub there, man. Dare I be so devious? Wukong is bot lane? It seems like an opportunity for greatness. I don't think I'm ready to listen to Industry Baby right now. I'm expecting like Yoni flinging himself over this wall like any moment. Wish my pee go. You need to get more monster energy in your life. If you, if you, want, if you really want to attain that level of perfection, you got to get some monster energy in your life. That shit will glow in the dark, man. You know what? Put on Slee. Sure. I do love this song. I really insult all the grinds vision of shit that it hits when it's like in the jungle, right? Okay, I think I think I'm gonna go stride breaker. Here's my logic. I don't have any form of CC from bear form. So at least with stride breaker, I do have some form of soft CC in my kit that can do like something to try and attain ganks. What's this music? What the I like this song! It's just a little bit of like Look, they got like, like a little bit of like math core in the guitar licks, you know, it's very cool. What little, little Japanese band? I don't think they're little. Bit eclectic as well. I'm not thinking Japan in you right now, but they are good and they just happen to be from Japan.
I gotta catch up on this CS, man. Oh, the chicken crew. Oh, that was a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're 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 weirdos for sure. How do we get more grubs in the enemy team? We got two. They got one. That shit's embarrassing, man. You guys gotta pick your shot. This is the resurrection of man. Right, give me a couple seconds. Okay, I'm in. Oh, it's a shame. I walked into. Uh, I gotta go. I'm not gonna be able to run this, dude. I'm, I haven't got bear stats to go faster. <laughs> oh my god, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy crap. What the fuck was that, man? Oh, Jesus. That was fucking scary. We went one for one on it though somehow. I didn't get an assist. I didn't hit the motherfucker, man. You wanna be an ASOL main? A Aurelian Soul is, is very uh, pretty in this game. Oh, I didn't get the fucking smite on it, man. I was trying to smite it so it wouldn't crash tower. Yeah, Bad for me. I just love dragons. This game has a lot of dragons. There's a sexy dragon lady in this game. Called Shivana. And she turns into a dragon because she's half dragon. But she's definitely a scaly, for sure. Chat, we have got any pro we got any problems with scalies here? No? None? Okay, perfect, thank you. We got blue buff here if anybody wants it. I kind of just want to push for stride breaker so I have some. I have at least one button to press that isn't right click. Hmm. Okay, I can maybe come in here. Maybe, maybe we commit, right? We commit. Okay, maybe. Mm. I think it's still committable, though. Shit. Oh, fuck. It's so hard. I don't have flash. I guess David's low. I don't think. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I think, I think David's been scarred this game, man. I don't think he's looking to make any fights like this. I thought maybe so, but no, you know, I don't know. That's a shame. I wasn't able to do much there. Not do as much. I couldn't do as much as I wanted to. Hmm. What's our win con though? I think win con's like probably Vladimir. He's doing okay, I think, right? Two, one, three. It's gonna be a slow process, but first item. Oh, wait, he's going for his first item. Which bean? Uh. I think that might be a dead Vladimir, unless W comes up in time. I mean, they're all skill shot based. Like he could be, he could do some fucking. <gasps> he could do some fast moves. He could do some fast moves. That double? No, it's not a double. Uh, I was kind of hoping for like one or two more CS here so I could get Stride Breaker, but I appreciate it, David. Man, thank you. Where is Lush today? Oh, is it actually? That's nice. I have not looked outside like at all, unfortunately. I got up. Did a little bit of work, spoke to my therapist, and I'm like straight here, man. <laughs> Plenty of time for the sun when it's night, you know what I mean? Okay, time for me to actually genuinely participate here. Okay, I mean that 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 is fucking horrible actually. <laughs> oh my god! Aurelia comes in with fucking uh skies descend, like powered up. That's bad timing, bro. That's bad timing. 
Man, man. I mean, only I died, so like it really is actually not that bad. Never mind. The Australian's fucking flying over Blasco and he's like crazy, man. He's too deep though. I don't I don't think that's a good idea that what he's doing right now. Yeah, he's made a terrible decision for sure doing this. He's dead. Yeah. Perfect. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Oh, we got Strike Breaker. Okay. I think I think there's potential here, actually. Depends. Hmm. It's so hard. It's so hard to get in on that. Like Velcos, the entire team is so hard to get on. We have like a wall of melee, and we're into like Ziggs, Velcos, Aurelian, Sol, uh, Wukong. I mean, even like Yoni can be annoying to try and get in on in melee range, just because he's like super mobile. But we're doing okay given the circumstances, I think. Fine. I guess now we're done. Oh yeah, we're through. This is this isn't Udyr anymore. This is just John. Oh, I hope you're all happy to meet. What the fuck? This is this this guy's. This is John. I, I'm I'm trying to maintain distance here. I do not want him on my ass. Wait, at least wait, wait for him to pop cycle before I do that shit. He still got me, dude. His Q range. No. I didn't even get the assist because my fucking strike breaker didn't come up, man. Ah! I'm bad. We gotta go. We gotta go tank. I think maybe. I think yeah. I think Jack Show is gonna be the play here. I think the game's gonna end before that because I'm a, a complete fucking liability. But we haven't done as badly as I thought we would do. But I honestly don't think I could think of a worse team to be playing against than this team. It would be difficult. Maybe Jax would be worse. I don't. I. I. I'm. I'm. I'm really pausing to find a team that was worse than this, and I don't think it's possible. And I'm not kidding. A lot of like shit that does not want you playing melee range against them. I mean, I'm. I'm just trying to get on the fucking tower, and I'm getting thirty skill shots and an ulti on me, man. Okay. Big news. I think I just walked through like. And I, I walk through an ability and, and that's my that's my HP left, man. You could have had me. <laughs> I will admit, right? I I swear we would doing be doing a lot better if like if they're pumping always on me and committing to fights. We would do pretty well if, if we, if we had a a, a win con that was in the position to take advantage of it. I think, and it's a shame because we got we got some scalers and stuff like that, and it's just we're not quite there yet. We can give it another try though. May I do I want to give it another try? I would like to play a champion that like gets to use your abilities. We can maybe try it another time, and finish off this video. It gives me an excuse to finish it off because it's not gonna get posted until I get another one. Or maybe I just get out of the way. Because I know there's potential in them there wars. I wish everything didn't slow me. Like every ability slowed me horribly. I kind of want to go Negatron, but like for the amount of AP damage they're putting out here, but... I don't know about chain vest because I'm fucked up in the head. Okay, we're dead here. That's him dead as well. Boom. We actually get an assist. It's a great day. We're holding on. I don't know how we're holding on, but we are holding on. Nature rush sunfire. That's not a bad idea, actually. I'm, I could take I could take that on board. We could try that again. Mm -hmm. I think we get like a less bad, like like to be clear. Look at this team that we're against, man. It is horrible to play into for most of our team. 
We, we kind of got draft theft, I'm not gonna lie. Bring bang bang. All right, let's try Human Udyr one more time. This one will be better. This one will be better. This one will be better. Now it's really quiet. Ah, hold on, we put up. Bring, bring. Is that better? I see on I see I see. It's actually really good. I've read the full manga as well. Mashal is really is is actually solid. But it's exactly the kind of story that I like. Because I, I think we used to talk about, like, my uh, if anybody could make a D&D &D character for me that was, like, not a wizard, but, like, his whole thing was that he fucking hates wizards and is, like, immune to magic, and that's his whole thing. He's, like, like, he's fighting, he's just punching wizards in the face and doesn't care. That is literally the plot of Masho. Just a guy who's so buff and strong that he's just, like, I'm just gonna go to a magic school and start punching the shit out of people, man. It's not really, it's not exactly the plot, but it's still good. It's still a little bit quiet. Harry Potter, but if they lifted, yeah. I've never watched Harry Potter before or read them. I've watched like maybe skim through the first Philosopher's Stone. Uh, I think I missed a bow on it because I'm like, I never watched it when I was a kid and I don't really identify with like, like the characters as an adult. So I feel like that's like a big part of a lot of people's lives where they like maybe do that or that, whatever. But Bashel, yeah, I can get behind it. Cause I used I used to for what I some for whatever reason used to train a lot when I was a kid, but I used to be an athlete, Chad. Can you fucking believe that? I was like really, I competed in like um, hundred meter, like two hundred meter, and long jump, <clears throat> and then I got a, a tracheitis in my throat, which like made my throat close up a lot, and I was like bedridden for like a month, um, and then after that like. I just, like, I never got back on the boat, man, you know? I never got back on it. I f like, I remember, like, chasing my friends after school. We were just running around, and, like, I was so out of breath because I hadn't even been on my feet in, like, a month. And I was just like, fuck, man, this is tough. And then, uh, then I used to, I, I did training for, like, parkour and stuff like that, like, conditioning training and all this bullshit, and it was hard, but I never competed again, man. Sad. Which is why sometimes I can get a little bit competitive in League of Legends. If that makes any explanation for you. That guy, that guy fucking die here. If I'm honest with you. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm just gonna fucking die. If that's okay with you all. Okay, there we go. Did Muay Thai as a kid? You know, I'm so jealous of you. Muay Thai wasn't like when I first saw. So I obviously I don't know if I have if this is a similar story to any of you guys, but <clears throat> but um, when I was like thirteen, I saw Tony Ja in Ong Bak, and uh, I immediately like fell in love with Muay Thai, Ong Bak the Warrior shit like that. I Muay Thai was like so cool to me, but it was not. I feel like it wasn't like that global, you know? So I used to try and look for Muay Thai classes in my city to like learn to fight in that way. And I and I didn't, so I would like watch YouTube videos or watch like, I'd look up online on like this, like, you know, the moves and like how to do that. But I never got a chance to like actually train in Muay Thai, but it's really cool. Um, if I was ever gonna get into a fist fight, you know, Matt, I'd be, I'd be like this, man. Be on, I'll be on my shit right now. <laughs> be fucking doing the... <sighs> doing the Spartan kick, man. Hold on, maybe we can juggle this. Ah! <laughs> 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 uh, 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 I can't believe I'm living this, man. <laughs> Fucking hell, bro. I can't believe I'm alive. We're chilling. Ah, uh, dude, I'm, 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 I'm the goat of this, man. I'm the goat of killing uh, Krugs. Give me boots. 
I mean, it's gotta be like merch reds, right? It's just gotta be. I mean, I don't know. Do I really want it? Uh, maybe I just oh, let's see. Knock up. Wait, oh no, actually, maybe not. Knock up. Sleep. I don't know if that's affected by tenacity. Uh, shockwave not really affected by tenacity. At the same time, I don't know, like slow resistance maybe for like W Cogma SETI not really affected by it. Maybe I don't then. Maybe I just go for this instead. It's true, man. Do you know what's really funny? People attribute that quote to me sometimes, even though I just stole it from somewhere. I stole it from like a t shirt that went hard. If you're gonna fight, you fight like the, the third monkey on the ramp at Noah's Ark, and brother, it's starting to rain. Like, yeah, I got counter jungled, man. Wait, who am I against? Silas? I appreciate that people think that I made that. But the only one that I made up recently is Call Me Apu, The Way I Make Her Come Again. And that did not go down well. Let me assure you the first time I said that on stream. But I'm taking credit for it because I fucking googled it and no one has said it before. Or at least nobody's taking credit for it on the internet, right? I'm also scared to tweet it though because uh, it would ask a lot of questions. Apu from One Piece? No, Apu Nahasapi Mepetilon from, uh, from The Simpsons, mate. Which who I don't think is actually in The Simpsons anymore. So it's a bit of a dated reference at the best of times. Ah. <laughs> that was the most lukewarm reaction to learning who that is. I haven't seen The Simpsons. What the fuck, dude? It's like one piece like The Simpsons is like one piece for suburban white kids, man. I'm Danish. The fuck do you mean? It's global, brother. What do you mean? How old are you, man? Says Shanks. It's like Simpsons Mania was like a thing, brother. It, it took over the damn world. You're 21. Ah, oh, shut the fuck up. Sorry. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Get out of here. Oh, you know what, man? I've realized I'm fucking dumb for trying this, actually. Hold on, though. We got Cribbly. We got Cribbly. Man, like. You're pissing me off. You know that? Guys? <laughs> I got you. Don't worry, I'm here. Shut up, Poindexter. I suddenly feel old. Hey, you're fucking telling me, mate. Twenty one. Fucking incredible news, man. Incredible. Surely like the Simpsons was on when you were I don't know, you should have been born earlier. Yeah, you should be. You should have you you should have already you should have bought property in two thousand and eight, idiot. This guy's ass in 2008. He's a little baby, still wrapped up in the fucking blankie. Fucking idiot. You should have been buying land. You should have fucking been buying land, Sashanks. What were you doing? My God. Think about what your, your portfolio would look like if you just bought land in 2008 or 2009. You fucking idiot. I don't know, kicking rocks. I mean, you'd be like seven, eight years old. So my ass, you're probably like, you know, what the fuck did what the fuck would eight and nine year olds be learning in school at that time? I don't know, like learning about countries of the world, maybe taking like a small little like light dive into like what religion actually is at this point. Like, uh, I don't know. You still you still believe Santa is real at this point though, so I don't know. But anyway, your network is your net worth, okay? And your ass was sleeping on that shit in two thousand and eight, man. I was I was like what two thousand and eight? I would have been like, I'd have been eighteen. You already know my ass was a venture capitalist, man. I was I was going crazy. Does Udir even exist? The fuck me? What's he fuck me for? Are you a drunkard?
Can I get banned for saying that? I don't know why I said that, man. No response as well is like the worst part. <laughs> I don't know. If only I had kicked Morse code in the womb to tell my parents to buy Apple stock and Bitcoin. You know what the worst thing is? I think I was like 12 years old and I could have, I could have, I could have, I could have been a gazillionaire. Is that not the worst part? I've told this story before, but like my, my mega mind Jimmy Neutron head looking ass friend Ricky told me about Bitcoin when I was like 12 or 13 and he, and he put a miner on my computer. And I was like, oh, sick, I'll use this to mine some Bitcoin. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. It was worth like less than a dollar at this point. We're, we're talking like almost 20 years ago or some shit. So anyway, I wanted to play Team Fortress 2 because the beta had just released. <clears throat> so I fucking got rid of it. I, I couldn't be arsed with that shit. I didn't want that shit on my computer because it was making my computer heat up and slow down. So I was like, nah, anyway. So anyway, that shit would have been... If I had just done it for a couple of days, probably would have made like 60 grand in today's money or something. Would have been pretty swag. But at the same time, Team Fortress 2 was pretty good. So like... Every, I think everyone has one of those stories. When you hit 30, you've already probably fucked up enough things that you've... You could have been a millionaire somewhere down the line. You just did something incorrectly. And that's not really the healthy way to look at it. I learned that video games are good and money is not the be all and end all. And that's what I'm going to tell myself when I eat my instant ramen and and have and, and try and put myself to sleep at night, okay? Video you're on Gromp River Blue Gromp. Huh? Get fucking CIA tracking me, man. I'm really confused as to like what I'm seeing, but I I, I think it works. I I mean, I'm struggling to figure out. I'm struggling to parse what just happened. We did kill one of them though, and that's good. And I'm and I'm like tempted to start this camp and then see if they commit to Oh no. No. Should have put a ward down. I know that there's a ward like right there. I didn't think it would be Cogmo though. I didn't think it would be Cogmo. Now your dad's gonna get a blow job too, man. Yeah, fuck him. You know what? No, he's not sniping. The, he dropped. A, he sat here, dropped a ward there. So there is a ward like right there. I'm gonna do the camp, man. I know he can see me, but I'm gonna do the camp anyway. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, he's not sniping. He just, he just like saw the. He just saw me on that. If you keep this up, buddy, your dad's getting a bullet job while he's at it. Yeah. True. 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 Keep, keep fucking pushing me, man. Keep pushing me. See what happens to your dad, man. He's getting, he's getting sucked off, man. I'm gonna suck him dry. Sorry. Ay, ay, ay. Jesus Christ, Fabulous. Like you joined at a bad time, right? Yeah, like, listen, how long have you been here for? How long have you fucking been here for? Okay. Judge me not by my words, but by the 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 by my character. Okay. Not long enough, it seems. Mm -hmm. That is like the most out of pocket thing I've said today. In all honesty, it's not that weird, man. Dad, dads get sucked off all the time. Your dad's probably getting. Your mom's probably sucking your dad off right now as we speak, man. Some somewhere, one of you. What some at least statistically people watching the YouTube video at least there's got to be at least one person whose dad is getting sucked off, you know? By their mother. Not their mother, but like their the person's mother. My parents hate each other. I feel that, dog. <laughs> I feel that, dog. Mm. Mm 
You're kind of weak. We can win this game. Sign's doing well, which means we have a win condition. You see me? Yep. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I gotta put my fucking thumb in this dickhead's eye, man. Okay, perfectly normal amount of damage to be done to me. What team are you gonna work anyway? I think my dad is having a threesome with this new weed dealer. Huh? Hold on, hold on, wait a minute. You think? You know. How do you think that? And how do you know it, to be honest, I guess? He's never even smoked weed until like this year. He's back to bachelor. He's going bachelor mode. Respect, man. I mean, honestly, like, live your life, man. I ain't here to judge, you know what I'm saying? No, we're living in the fast lane. Speed up. His bachelor, his, his bachelor mode is ultimate for him. I'm ready. I'm ready to come out here. Mm. This slow? This little peanut brain ass is going for me, man. Whew. Have some of that! Honestly, hello, uh... That sounds like uh, that's a really like strange situation that I would absolutely adore to hear more about because it sounds incredibly interesting. But I'm t I'm maybe thinking maybe I wheel in the unhingedness of this this particular video thus far. Maybe I, I bring it back a little bit. How's everybody's uh, investments portfolio is doing? What are we saying? S and P five hundred is performing pretty well this year. I don't know. I mean, it's historically performed pretty well for like year over year for the last like four odd years. We had like a bit of a shaky one. I think it was like what twenty nineteen possibly like n m maybe m minus nineteen percent. But at the same time, you know, you're looking at like 20 so percent year over year. And I mean, I don't know, man. It's uh, that's pretty impressive as far as she goes. Certainly outpacing inflation. And that's that's something just that's just something to be happy of in and of itself, you know? That being said, you gotta diversify. People don't really rate like uh you know, low yield premium bonds and stuff like that. But I think like if you're just putting like a little bit into it every month, it's probably still a good idea. You're not very likely to win anything on the bonds, but at the very same time, you could be a couple of extra pennies here and there over the course of like a, over the course of a year. It's government, you know, government funded, government subsidized, whatever. So yeah, you want to, you want to make some, some low risk investments in with the, the medium risk, you know what I mean? Unless you want to go absolutely ape mode and go straight for like I'm gonna I'm gonna invest in altcoins and try and moon myself to a Lamborghini, you know. In which case, sure, just make sure you're playing with money that you can afford to be losing. That's the most important thing. I didn't even break his shield. I do that little damage. <laughs> I don't even, I have I do have a sunfire cape though. In all fairness, Bosh. I don't invest, but I'm gonna have a decent pension. That's pretty good, yeah. But I still think, like, you know, even everybody always thinks, and I say that I say I'm saying say as I do, not say say as I do, not as I wait, do as I say, not as I do. That even um, ten bucks a month or something, if you can afford ten bucks a month to be putting into, you know, something like low yields, but also like, you know, something that's gonna get you some compound interest on it. It's probably worth doing. It's just going to be like a, make you a little bit more comfortable when the time eventually comes. Just putting a little bit of money that you're not going to miss. Instead of buying like a takeaway or buying some takeout food, instead of getting a McDonald's, put that money into something that will like uh, secure your future a little bit more, man. 
You gotta look out for number one, dog. You know what I'm saying? Get your money up, not your funny up. If it don't make dollar, it don't make sense. <laughs> I'm too far gone. Guys, by the way, I'm starting a stock trading podcast, by the way. Um, and I'm hoping that I, to, I can guest on the Talk To It podcast while I'm at it, so... I think me and uh, Haley Welsh will have like some interesting things to talk about, you know. She has, she's a very opinionated lady. What future world is going to shit? Well, before the hellfire rains down upon us, at the very least, you should be able to buy as much cocaine as possible when you take out all of your investments at the same time. Okay. Even if you think we're gonna just fucking die in a ball of fire in like 40 years, 39 years from now, you're gonna be thanking me and you're gonna be getting a, you're gonna have one motherfucking hell of a party, boss, let me tell you that. <laughs> that is her name. Her name is Haley Welch. Yeah. I'm committed, man. I want to know what happens with her and Pookie, man. I need to know what happens with her and Pookie. I need to know, like, what her thoughts are on... Wed. I don't know what... I don't know. Actually, I'm not really sure what she talks about on her podcast with, about, you know, but... Did I go a, a coke nail in preparation for that? No, because, like, if, if we're about to die in a ball of fire, you're just going to... What you're going to do is you're going to get a gigantic bag of coke, you're going to open it up, and you're going to stick your face in it and breathe in. That's what you're going to do, Okay. If we're if we're if we're at 11:59 p.m., we're like 30 seconds from midnight. Fuck it, brother. I can't get away from this fucking this Zoe man. Okay, she oh okay, Botling did pretty well actually. I mean, yeah, they got some kills. Scary. I get the assist on this if you don't make me ask him. Nice. I got my assist. I got mine. I uh, John John I don't think John can defend, because now that I've actually like bought like tank items, I John's not doing a whole heap of damage here. I, you know what? You know what's funny? I'm having a fun time somehow. And it's only because I'm just talking nonsense, right? I mean I know that that's how it generally goes, but still, you know, still. That's what it's all about, baby. <laughs> this call money's a fucking uppercut, man. Last night, and you're gone. Yeah, John, I'm, I'm honestly role-playing as John right now. John could not give a f single fuck about what's going on in this game, man. He just cares that, like, he gets to have a single, one single beer after work and then go home with the wife and kids, man. He don't care. You think he gives a fuck about Rude and Terror, man? He cares about, like, the Johnson accounts, man. They gotta be done by Friday, okay? If this shit ain't done by Friday, 5 p.m., man, that means he's gotta come in on the weekend and that shit is not gonna happen. <laughs> I invoke the ancient right to cash shit yourself. Well, that's just rude, isn't it? I, I there, there's a Tumblr account. Who am I gonna give it to? I'll give it to Val. I um, there's a Tumblr account, and I can't. I don't know how to find the tweet, but it's just like <laughs> a Tumblr account that posts like as if they're like writing a diary from the 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 POV of like being part of a wizard war on the front lines and he's talking about how he, he's like jesus fuck man it's so fucked out here wait i think i just heard power word scrunch coming two groups over man i just watched a man's tibia fucking explode from inside his body man this fucking war is hell like get me out of here <laughs> i just watched a man get fucking turned inside out man he just disintegrated and it's just like some fucking poor shell shocked like wizard soldier giving a fucking uh, diary on how horrible the war is. 
I'm casting level two frostbite and poison. So yeah, true. I just heard power word scrunch coming from two fucking groups over. Oh shit, man. You know exactly the one I'm talking about, man. You know exactly the one I'm talking about. Anyway, um, I did 700 damage. That was a pretty good game. I had a blast. Listen, I know this is a weird video, but we talked and we had some fun, and I, I greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much for stopping by today and spending some time with me. You know why I love it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, by all means, subscribe. Give the video a like. Check out uh, twitch.tv slash rossboomsocks if you're interested in joining some of these games. I promise they will not be like this. I would maybe try and do some ones where I actually do a thing, okay? Um, but regardless, have a great day. Take care. I'll see you next time.